This poem has absolutely nothing to do with my family. I will repeat that. This poem has nothing to do with my family at all, sort of. It's called Blood E Relatives. A hey up, said our mum to our dad. I've just heard from cousin Prue. Her says we gotta go to club to neat, them throwing us a surprise do. The pair of them pulled sour faces, mam looking most deranged. They'd been married for forty years, with barely a pleasant word exchanged. All their five offspring were there, reading congrats cards and cracking jokes. Dad was downing pints of Worthington. Mam was on pints of rum and coke. Presents presented were of the useless sort, destined for the back of their loft. Mam was given a bunch of gladdies, which set her a fever off. The old girl was in a right bad mood. Her speech was short and gruff. I wouldn't have married this miserable old sod if I hadn't have been up the duff. Dad was pissed off, and very pissed. He stared Mam in the eye. Ah, and I wouldn't have married thee if I'd known the bastard weren't mine. Mam broke a walking stick on Dad's head, said, look what you've gone and done. Our sister pushed Dad over the table, then everybody joined in the fun. Our Joe smacked Brother John a belter, must have cracked his jaw. Why'd you do that? whined the injured sibling. Dunno, said Joe, hitting John once more. Ancient slights were remembered. There was a settling of various scores. Cousin versus cousin, aunt against aunt. And of course, everyone belted the in-laws. Botany Bay Bruce, cousin twice removed. Not removed far enough, some said. Grabbed Granny Trickett's full colostomy bag and emptied it on Uncle Fred's head. Uncle Bill whispered to his neighbour Jill something that gave her the hystericals. Bill's wife Lil took this ill and stabbed him in the sphericals. The hired amateur DJ put a record on and switched on the cheap strobe lighting. His choice of song in retrospect was wrong. Or had he only got kung fu fighting? Broken tables and chairs, bodies and glass littered the function room floor. Still the family, in-laws and neighbours battled, even after the committee called in the law. The paramedics were the first to arrive, then the police with shields and stab vests. The crowd united against the constables. It took eight hours to make an arrest. In the back of the Black Mariah, Mam whispered lovingly in Dad's ear, That party were bloody good, Duck. Shall us have another next year? <laughs>